Hello, you're welcome to another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can send messages to your clients or to your subscribers on their birthday automatically. So first of all, before you can actually send any messages to your subscribers, you need to have their birthday date. And I've already explained that in a video. So if you don't know how to go about that, you can actually click the info card at the top of the video, or you can click the link in the description, which I'm going to provide there for you to watch. So before we get started, if this video is very helpful to you, please don't hesitate to click the subscribe button. That will encourage me to make more helpful videos. Thank you very much in advance for that. And if you want me to work with you directly in your email marketing project, you can actually send me a message by clicking the link in the description, which will take you to my Fiverr page. I'm always available and ready to help. So with that being said, let's get started. So the first thing you need to do is just to come all the way down to automation so you can see automation right here you can just click on automation so then right here you can see this you can see this checkout classic automation so you can just click on this then right here under this feature tab you can see say happy birthday so all you just need to do is just to click on this then you can give your cap your birthday campaign a name so let us leave it like this i think this is still okay so you can just click on begin so this is this one is actually if you want to send just only one single message so preferably maybe you want to send them a message on their birthday but at the same time too it also depends on the kind of business that you run let us assume you run a photography business now and you actually intend to take like um birthday pictures of your clients so you can actually send them a message before their birthday it's maybe like something like hey your birthday is in the next 14 days so we are just trying to say happy birthday in advance, blah, 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 blah. And we'll also be available to take your pictures. So things like that, you already understand what I'm trying to talk about. So it, and it depends on your business or maybe if you're actually selling um, gift items, it depends on how your business actually runs. So you can actually decide to send them messages on their birthday or you can send them messages on their, before their birthday. So, but let us assume you actually wish to send multiple messages like maybe so maybe before their birthday on their birthday after their birthday things like that so you can actually use this email series so but for you to be able to use this email series you actually have to be on a standard plan but it's actually a free account which i'm just which i'm using to explain to you how to do all this but once you follow this simple step you can actually use the, use it on this email series so there's nothing difficult about that what you just need to do now is just to click on begin so right here you can see this is the date field so this is birthday so it means that whatever message you actually type in here is actually is what they are going to keep receiving year after year so you don't even need to stress yourself except you wish to actually um, change the message that they receive the following year so the first thing you can see here you can see the day before their birthday maybe if this is actually if you want to send them a message before their birthday but if you want to send them a message on their birthday all you just need to know all you just need to take notice of is this trigger right here you can see this trigger one day before birthday so it means like this let us assume someone's birthday is tomorrow if you prepare this email campaign and activate it it means that they are going to actually receive their birthday message today but if you want them to actually to receive the message on that day you just need to click on edit right here so you can see here one day before so all you just need to do is just to go to this here so you can see on the day of so you just click on, on the day of so it means that on their birthday date, that is when they are actually going to receive a birthday message from your company or from your business. So you just need to click on update trigger right here. So on their birthday, so that's when this that's when it's going to happen. At what time you can just you can change the time. Maybe if you want them to maybe if you want um, to send it to them by 12 a.m., you want to be the first person to actually send them a message, something like that. So filter you can just leave all this one for now let me not go too deep into that once you are done with this then the next thing you just need to do is just to go to design email so right here you can just prepare you can prepare whatever you want so this is the email subject maybe you can write something like happy birthday, happy birthday. from you need to put, it's very important to put your the from from maybe xyz company so the reason why I the reason why I put this as the subject is whenever um, your subscriber receives such message, they will know that it's from you. That's number one, and number two is also going to increase your open rates, and it will also make them know that that you actually care about them. 
So once you are done with this, then you can just click on next. Then you select the templates. So you can just pick any template that you want. So depending on your plan, some of this will actually be available for you to use. So, but I just prefer to go to Teams right here because it's actually way faster. So you just need to select the team, then, then, then you can just begin to change the colors and whatever. So let us assume we want to use this one. I'll just click on this. So right here, you can put in your logo. You just need to click on this, they select your logo. Then you can just edit all this. So let us assume you own an e-commerce company that sells different products. You can also sell things to them on their birthday. You can, by giving them a discount as a present, after after congratulating them on their birthday, then you can tell them that we also have a present for you. And we are going to be giving you some amounts, some discounts on your next purchase, maybe within the next seven days, because if you don't put that, it's possibly never going to happen. But if you actually put a time boundary, that maybe within so this period of time, if you buy, you can buy anything with this amount of um, discount. It's also going to increase your sales, and all this is actually done automatically. So you can actually type all that. Then you just need to put a button. Then you need to put it. Then you can just put a button. So this is a button right here. Where is the button? This is it right here. You can just click a button. You click the button. Then put it. Put it then you can maybe type something like maybe um claim discounts claim discounts claim discounts then you put in the link to your store so the link to your store so they can just click on it then and to take them straight to your store so they can actually buy anything on your store in your store so that's another way to actually to also increase that's another way to increase sales or you can also make use of this promo code but if you are going to make use of this promo code you need to make sure that your store is also connected to mailchimp so when you, so when you are done all you just need to do is just to click on save and continue right here so right now everything is set then you can just click on next so when you are done you can just click on start sending and boom your message is going to be ready so to be sent anytime any of your email subscribers has a birthday so that is how it is done so that's going to be the end of this video if you actually learned something in this video please don't hesitate to click the subscribe button and also click the notification bell if you also have any question please let me know in the comment box below i'm going to go i'm going to answer every single question that you have and don't forget i'm always available to help you on your email marketing project you can just send me a message on fiverr if you need any help with email marketing so thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video